candles. Oh, I remember the film about these. Uh, what was it? About the uh, the Jewish mob. A long film. One of them was called Needle Needles. Well, here it is, the needle. Hey. So it was a once upon a time in the West or needles. So now we know what a needle is. He was a uh, uh, a kosher mos nostra. So this is where the Swiss uh, CIA is. There, there's the entrance there. They're really bad people. They killed a lot of people uh, by O2T torture. Actually, they murder people here. See the fence there as well. Swiss flag, the Templars flag there. See, very, very dangerous. So this is the famous bear pit here in Bern, where all the tourists go. You see, it's like a castle, but this is not important. What's important is this here, an obelisk. There, this is the joining on top here. The symbol of the world domination. And uh, this is the sun hieroglyphics. The most, one of the most important symbols. You see it everywhere. And it's so, um, it's so hidden. It's so hidden. You see it as well on American airplanes, you know, with the star in the middle. And the two bars on each side, that's the sun hieroglyphics. And actually, the German army, you have the SS. If you write ISIS in Pharaonic, like in Hebrew or the Arabic, you write only the uh, consonant. So if you write ISIS, you get SS. And if you take the symbol of the SS, it's skull and bones. So under the uh, symbol of total. Um, Pharaonic and Freemasonry symbolics. Uh, the um, the SS murdered people all over Europe, and they got killed themselves. So SS skull and bones. See SS is ISIS. Good. Let's go and see further up. So this is the most important symbols. You see it a lot in American movies as well. This one here. Then the joining, very important. The world domination, of course the obelisk, and the triangle of the Pharaoh, of the Freemasons. Well, you don't see it here. Okay. So this is still in Bern, Altenberg. And here's the river, the Aare next to it. The obelisk with a grain on it. That means our seed is here. Our descendants are here. It's still the same thing. And this is this phallic. It's a symbol of the... Uh, it's also the symbol of their way of warfare. Let's mix first. And uh, then we conquer the people from the inside out, like a virus, like the enemy within. You know, and we have our secret lodges, the Freemasons. Let's take, for instance, like here in Bern or in Switzerland or in Europe, you see a white woman. Well, she's apparently one of the uh, one of the uh, witches, the sisters of Isis, and uh, she has a black dude, and the, they're gonna have a child, which is. Uh, Going, the child is going to be brown, like a uh, the offspring. The uh, here in Switzerland, the father usually never sees his child anymore because he's going to be sent away. He's going to be extradited back to uh, back to Africa. The poor guy. Uh, if it's a lady child, the brown one, she's going to have she's going to have um, she's going to look for another black dude at the train station, the railway station, or the disco and um, they're gonna have a baby and the baby of the um, will already be much blacker much browner the father is going to be sent away the child is going to be risen in a black manner as always three generations later the offspring will be black as a central african from congo but inside is what yeah it's white of course and then they're gonna put the white nigger they're gonna put him a um, uh, he's going to do some some academic studies, you know, at the university, and uh, then they're going to put him as a president, like uh, the president of Congo, Joseph Kabila. He's a white nigger, and all the black dudes think, oh, he's white. He's uh, one of us. He's a black dude. He's got our color. He speaks like us, but he isn't. And this is how the whiteies they can rob Africa, and they can make wars. So the petrol and the diamonds, they all get cheaper. 
and uh, kill everyone. And of course we know now it's not the whites who have the power. They were just the soldiers, Germanic warriors like whom the pharaohs could use so well, you know. So, um, <clears throat> and of course the same system, the same technique or strategy the pharaohs did in Europe as well. Like with the five generations and the, uh, and the mixing. That's why we have the obelisk everywhere. Yeah, with our seeds here. See? Good. This church too, it's full of obelisks. What's an obelisk doing on a church? Well, that's, it's from the priest of Amun. Amun Ra. Bad ones. So, obelisks on a church. You know, the Vatican. The triangle of the Freemasons. And uh, this bridge was built by Napoleon, who ruled like 20 years in Bern, and the upper class in Bern, the capital of Switzerland, uh, it comes from that time, they call it the Bernburger. Yeah, and Napoleon, he loved Egypt, as we know, right? So here we see the joining there, the triangle of the Freemasons. I counted the stones, there are 33. And the top stone is called the keystone. As all the pictures in the newspapers, they're called keystone. Yeah. Very Masonic. They're insiders, like a virus. How do we get them out of here? There we got the uh, sun hieroglyphics, the house next, next to, the, uh, to the bridge. And uh, let's have a closer look at the obelisk. Here's the house on top of it. Now, well, the lift is here. The sun hieroglyphics. It's a real perverted symbol because it's so, so hidden. It's so, so hidden. There again, or there. And on top is the grail. That means our blood is here, we are here. Our grains are here, our blood is here. So this is the same bridge. And I was here in 2007. And about there underneath, the guy jumped off the bridge smacked the floor and uh, oh, it was such a bang it was like two cars hitting each other amazing and a metallic bang actually uh, and uh, yeah so here's the obelisk left, uh, as, as on the cemetery when somebody died you know yeah. and then I went to this restaurant here which is called um, Altenberg it's Turkish now and exactly there, this last table, there was the, uh, the, uh, the one of the seven presidents of uh, Switzerland. They got seven presidents here. Her name was Doris Lothart. And she was sitting just next to the, uh, the sun hieroglyphics here. She knew it. And I asked her, I said, you, your citizens are jumping off the bridge. And I said, well, oh, I'm not interested. This is not my job. You know, very cold. And she was talking with a guy, I think he was from the safe house of the Mossad, which is just next to here, and I'll just read with the, uh, the obelisk on it. This is the safe house here. This is where they, you see the symbol, this is where they come when they... when they want to put out some uh, Arabs in Europe. And this is a, uh, a camera, and it can swing around. Probably will now. Yeah. All right. So there's the bridge with the obelisks. Yeah. And here is the uh, the Mossad safe house. It's just here. Here they just take it easy. A nice tree here. Now watch some TV. And then they concentrate on putting out some tangos. Arabs. So there's the obelisks. In that street is the safe house and here's the Turkish restaurant. Uh, the hitmen are surely just going to eat here. They've got all the protection of the Swiss state. Oh, yeah. So if you just look around here, you know, you'll find them. Yeah. And then they go and swim in the river, you know. So. Maybe somebody can do something back. So, here we got a very big pharaonic temple. Very big. 
next to the Vatican. Excuse me, I meant to say next to the Embassy of the Vatican in Bern. Yeah. So, here we got the joining. You see? The triangle of the Pharaoh, of the Freemasons. There's Isis on top. With breast. Here we got the, um, it's the devil. And this is the all seeing eye, like on the dollar, in gold. It's so important they put it in gold. Here we got the sun hieroglyphics. It's all there, you see? It's all there. And there are two obelisks next, next to it the world domination. The joining, again the world domination next to it here, and another obelisk with the world domination. Good. This is, um, yeah, and this is the uh, some old Egyptian pharaonic bird. And there, next to it is the garden of the embassy of the Vatican. So let's go and have a look. Here we got the Vatican door. Yeah. With the big temple with the obelisks here. We said Schloss Hindelbank. We can have a look there as well. Uh, that's the embassy. A lot of loads of obelisks. Yachim and Boaz. So there's a quick look of the garden of the uh, the embassy of the Vatican. Uh, there it is. You see the two keys of the Vatican. So here are the obelisks here. Now what's an obelisk doing here? Well, it's the priest of Amun, Amun Ra. This is Egypt. And these priests of Amun, they rape our children. And the Pope is the head of a child molester circle, a pedophile organization. He's the head of it. And it's all Egypt here. This is all Egypt. Even the joining that behind it. There's the joining, like in a Freemasonry temple. You see. All right. We better go because before the Inquisition and the cops come. They're usually sitting in their house there, with a machine pistol. And this is where the... Uh, and that's... You know, okay, that's the Swedish embassy. There, at the embassy, there's the, uh, the grail. A fair running. That's our cedars here. And again, some obelisks. With the world domination. And that's the flag of Canada. Same thing. Flag of Canada. You see? Two obelisks. Oh, who's ruling here, eh? <laughs> That's Belgium. There we got the joining all over. The top as well, the triangle of the Freemasons. And this means our seat. Well, through the tram you can see where the... Uh, where the bars, where the prison is, is the Israeli embassy. Well, I'm not going to get near her because the cops and police are going to be crawling over here. This is where the temple... Oh, the Vatican has a lot of dough. You know, they have a lot of money and power. This is their garden. Jesus, it's big, eh? It's big. It's a castle. Yeah. So, I mean... Criminals go well, eh? And child molesting pays off. Yeah, it's the backside of the Canadian Embassy. Look at it. What a castle, all these symbols here, all pharaonic stuff here. That's the the, the, uh, the joining, Freemasons. On top here is the uh, the triangle of the Freemasons. And look at this here. And look at the big garden. I mean, there's all descendants of the pharaohs and key positions all over. They have a good life. See? The Canadians are just there for sweating. Now waging war in Iraq or Afghanistan. Fuck man. Uh, the backside of the uh, the Belgium embassy. The Grail two times. Our descendants are here. 